Last time you had two bladed props, right? Yeah. Yeah, it doesn't really matter. But... Get away some of the dirt. <laughs> Very nice, dude. Yeah. So very nice. It looks a lot more stable. So basically, the way it works is one engine gives more, and the one engine backs off to get it to go orientation-wise, different places? Yeah, one side, actually. So front, the two front rotors right. will slow down and the two back ones will speed up to make it go forward. And uh, get over the other way. And then rudder control is diagonal. So that's got to take a lot of testing to figure out like how much is too much and how much is not enough. Yeah, a little bit. It yeah. wasn't actually that bad. A little bit of just trial and error, but... Rudder, like a rudder gyro, but I don't have that right now, and it twists a bit more than it should. Trying to get a feel for it, too. I really need something to tell orientation, but I don't have that. I was going to say, dude, yeah, that's got to be really hard. It looks symmetrical. Let's make sure I can see the, uh, the little receiver on the back. But yeah, once I, like I want to put a canopy on it or something like that. Right, that'll like the one you had before. Yeah, and that'll make me a lot Just more something fun. little, yeah. But yeah, it's pretty stable as it is. It's getting there. You know, it's still part pilot keeping it steady, but but it doesn't take a lot now. It used to, like it used to be fight like hell to keep it ready. And now it's not too bad. Nice, dude. Very nice. Things crazy looking. Looks like some military yeah. some weird unmanned freaking floating just death machine or something. Oh, wait till I mount the lasers in the flux capacitor. <laughs> Sounds like a bumblebee.
Yeah.